welcome Drew Barrymore. <laughs> Yeah, come Monday, you're going to have something new to watch here on Fox 2 at 2 p.m. Actor Drew Barrymore, now a daytime talk show host, and it premieres on September 14th. And we are delighted to be joined here in St. Louis by Drew Barrymore. Hello to you. Hi, Randy. How are you? We are great. And I believe the last time we saw you in St. Louis is when you filmed the movie Fever Pitch, 2005, 15 years ago at Bush Stadium with Jimmy Fallon. You remember that? Um, I remember being a part of history. Yes. And that film was about loving someone who is always, you know, attached to something that lets them down, i.e. the Red Sox because they never win. Or, you know, it, that, that was a metaphor for anything. <laughs> and then they won! Yeah, what a St. crazy Louis. moment. Well, yes. well, Cardinals fans will welcome you back anytime. I'll just tell you that right now. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, I was there for a movie. It was incredible to watch history, but I celebrate everyone. I'm, I don't know if it works, and I might be naive, but I'm on everyone's team. Yeah, your show is being described as creating a movement to march in the army of optimism. What does that mean? Yeah. Well, I, I do believe in optimism, but I believe in an intelligent and hard fought for optimism. I don't like blind happiness. Like, look, if it happens and it's free, it, can you even receive it is almost a more interesting question. For me, happiness and optimism is something you work towards. It's a choice you make. And how you get to that choice, listen, it isn't always easy. It's difficult sometimes. And that path is so interesting to me because I do end up choosing belief in people and life, and I need to hear that life-affirming stuff. And sometimes we need tools and people to get there. So I would like this show to be that. Very good. And we know that premiere weeks usually are just filled with a lot of surprises. Anything you can give away for us right now? Well, um, I'm very excited about who our first guests are, because I think, you know, in this field, that is an important sort of planting your flag in the sand. And for me, I'm going to get to do it in a way that really celebrates friendship, uh, support of women, being a part of something I'm so proud of. Um, it's people I've experienced divorce, life, birth, death, and creativity <laughs> and fun and adventure with. So to me, I feel like that says it all. Variety is the spice of life. We experience so many different things. So if we can put that melting pot into an hour, that is what I would like to tackle. And the first people who are coming on the show kind of say everything about that for me. And Fantastic. And it's me. I want to, I want to extend myself to everyone and remain myself at the same time. Well, we've been watching you since you were a young kid, six years old, and we get to see you now again. And we thank you so much for joining us. Welcome back to St. Louis anytime, as we mentioned. And of course, the Drew Barrymore Show. Thank you, Show. Randy. It debuts on Monday at 2 p.m. right here on Fox 2. Hope to see you soon.